It was a tough, uh, tough loss for our team. I'd like to congratulate the Bears. They eh? very physical team, good defensive team. Way too many penalties. I think when you have eight holding penalties and you struggle in a short yardage situation uh, and field position is hard to come by, it's going to be a fist fist fight. And they won this one today. Congratulations to them. I think Jonathan Hankins is the only guy that didn't finish the game. He got hit in the back. Derek Carr. Uh, Hurt his neck a little bit, but was able to finish. Uh, with that said, I'll answer any questions I can. John, um, some drop balls, and penalties, like you mentioned. Um, maybe a little bit of lack of focus to start that game. You know, there's a lot that happened this week. Do you think any of No, I, you know, I can't speak for everybody. You know, we, we, um, we had a touchdown call back. Uh, we had two holding penalties. And uh, I can't speak for everybody, but um, – they're a good football team on defense, and they're, you know, they're rallying around their young quarterback with a new play caller, and they ran the ball extremely well. But um, I'm not going down that road. John, it's obviously real easy to, for anybody else looking in to, to use that, but the reality is back-to-back clunkers, if you will, against Chargers and the Bears. Is it just a collection of, of things? Well, obviously, we're trying to find our right mix up front. And I'm not going to point to the offensive line, but it was Parker's first game starting today. Um, Alex Leatherwood moved into right guard. And uh, we're trying to find the right mix. We're struggling right now to run the football. And obviously, our pass protection has to get better as well. Um, and we did drop some passes today that uh, really hurt us. But the penalties, uh, the penalties, they got to stop. We had some on defense that allowed them to continue drives as well. But, um, you know, it all falls back on me. Discuss how the defense played today. I think they played hard. They did some really good things. We struggled in the first half. We couldn't get the ball. Um, I think we only had 25 snaps of offense in the first half. Uh, we played better in the second half. We made some mistakes early in the football game defensively, but we still are looking for a turnover. You know, we've got to get some field position established. They're playing hard. We're doing some good things, and there's some individual efforts that are just outstanding. But it wasn't enough today. You got to win in all three phases. And um, we didn't do that today. John, you mentioned the offensive line and some of the moves that you made there. Uh, at first glance, um, any thoughts on it? And then also, do you feel like with that offensive line, the answers are here uh, in the building to get that thing done? Well, you know, we've lost a few guards. You know, Seymour got hurt right before camp and incognito and good. We didn't expect that to happen. But, you know, we're, we're capable of playing better. And uh, like I said, it was a first game for Leatherwood inside, first game for Parker working together on the right side. Uh, it was a short week, um, but we're going to continue the process and, and keep trying to find a way to get better and, and improve around the men we have. They're, they're doing some really good things, as overshadowed today by a really good front the Bears have. They're, they're a formidable front. Coach Gruden, um, obviously this is not a uh, game question. I just, just one question. Can the, can the NFL and the Raiders and the fans be sure – that there are not any other racial insensitive remarks by you out there in the atmosphere that could be published by the Washington Journal or any other publication? All I can say is I'm not a racist. I, don't, uh, I can't uh, tell you how sick I am. I apologize again to, to, to D. Smith, um, but I feel good about who I am and what I've done my entire life. And um, I apologize for the insensitive remarks. I had uh, no... Uh, you know, I, I, I had no racial uh, intentions with those remarks at all. But um, yes, they can. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm not like that at all. But I apologize. I don't want to keep addressing it. My, the, just my last question: Had the NFL contacted you, and, and uh, what was their response? Uh, what did, what was the response? I have not had any contacts with them yet. But uh, we'll see what happens here in the next few days. I guess that's my question. Do you expect something to happen? You know, I'm not going to answer all these questions today. I think I've addressed it already. Uh, I can't remember a lot of the things that transpired 10 or 12 years ago, but um, I stand here uh, in front of everybody apologizing. I know I'm not, uh, I don't have an ounce of, of racism in me. I'm a, a guy that takes pride in leading people together, and I'll continue to do that for the rest of my life. And again, I apologize to D. Smith and anybody out there that that I have offended, okay? All right, All right guys, thank you.